What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's gonna be a weekend in my life in Tampa, my hometown. I grew up here. This is my childhood bedroom that I actually recently kind of spruced up to make it a little bit more mature. I'm gonna be vlogging the next few days here at home. You guys love when I'm in Florida and I'm extra excited because some of my best friends from college who I went to Greece with are coming to town for 4th of July and just for all the fun. Um, so I thought I'd vlog like our next few days. But first, we have to thank today's sponsor who is... Abercrombie. Abercrombie is sponsoring this video and we all need to be excited, okay? I am I'm honored. I'm wearing Abercrombie. I have other Abercrombie items to show you guys. I am so into buying basics, neutrals, and then dressing it up with jewelry and Abercrombie is perfect for that. Like if you need like a capsule summer wardrobe, Abercrombie is it for you. I am just so excited to show you guys my pieces. So I'm gonna do a little try on haul, a little styling session for you guys. I haven't crimped my hair today. What do we think? All right, outfit number one. I have been eyeing this dress for so long and I finally got it. I saw one of my other favorite influencers wearing it and I was like, it's so flattering, it's so feminine. By the way, I'm gonna have all these products tagged on this YouTube video, which is really, really cool and a feature I'm excited to be using. So we love that and I'll have Abercrombie linked down below, of course. So this is like the detailing in the front right here. It's strapless and it's very secure, which feels really nice. Again, this beautiful feminine fit and then it goes down into kind of like a midi situation i just paired it with some black sandals i think this is just so perfect for summer like you could really just do so many things with this you could dress it up you could wear it with sneakers and stroll around whatever city you're visiting or just your hometown like it is just so beautiful it feels so feminine i think this would also be really cute with like a half up half down situation but i'm very happy with this dress I am so obsessed with this dress too. Like everything just fits so nicely. It's this beautiful long black maxi dress, but what I like the most about it is it has this beautiful drop waist and it also came in other colors. I picked black because I just loved it. <laughs> um, but yeah, so there's like a halter and then there's these straps, but like look at this detailing. And again, I just paired it with these black sandals because I thought it was so cute with some fun black oval sunglasses. This is just the epitome of summer to me in a dress. I think it is so beautiful. Again, just that feminine cut. I just feel like you can still see some of my curves, which is really nice. Um, but yeah, it's perfect. Again, you can wear sneakers too. Um, but I absolutely love this dress. Okay, we got two fun items here. This first item, a moment for this linen top. I feel so chic. I love the cut. I love the little cap sleeve situation here. So cute, it also came in other colors. I just loved white. You could also pair this with a pair of white linen pants. So cute, with like some wedges. Oh, I love nothing more than the Abercrombie Curve Love line. Like, you guys already know this. I have so many pairs of like the pants, the shorts, um, but these are like the split hem on the bottom, which I really, really liked. And I'm only five, I'm only five, three. I'm 5'3", so I actually got the short version. You can get tall, short, it's amazing. Um, just kind of catered to your height. And it's perfect, I don't have to get them hemmed or cut or anything, it's just the perfect length. I think these will look so cute with some heels. I like these things together. I think this top could be paired so many different ways. This could be dressed up or dressed down. You could wear like a black bodysuit with these pants, something like that. Um, but I'm very, very, very happy. I love this pairing. This is this beautiful like black linen crop tank situation. I love how it's boxy. I love the thick straps. And then I paired it with these black linen pants from Abercrombie that they button up, zipper, but then they're also like elastic. So they're just so freaking comfortable. And I just, this is an outfit right here. I mean, I just want to wear this every day for the rest of my life. Like if I switched out these earrings with like a really cute seashell earring or something and then wore some cute heels, boom, boom, boom. You could also wear these separately too. So I think these black linen pants would be really cute with a black bodysuit tucked in with lots of jewelry or you could do, you know, this top with jeans or with some shorts, a skirt, truly whatever. I just love it. I'm so obsessed with linen for summer right now. Like. I wish I just wore more linen, honestly. And the fact that it's black, it's just stain proof, which I just love wearing black things because if you spill something, you can't even see it. Honestly, that's where my head's at these days. Um, I just wore it with these black sandals again, but I think a really cute pair of heels would be cute too. But this might be, oh, 
I love the dress. I don't know. This is one of my favorite outfits. <laughs> and last but not least, you guys know I love a puffy top. I paired this top with the black linen pants, and it just looks so seamless, so chic. Like, I'm telling you guys, this is the new era for me. Look how cute this top is. It also came in other colors. I just wanted black. I love the puffy shoulders. I love the neckline. I love how it kind of like cinches right here. It's got some um, stretchiness in the back, which is really nice and easy to put on. I'm living in these pants. This shirt is so cute. Again, with the sandals, with sneakers, with heels, you could totally, all these items are so versatile for summer. I'm so obsessed. Like, she's in Lake Como. She's in Paris. Like. Excuse me? I'm obsessed. So I'm so obsessed with everything I just showed you guys. I hope you guys liked them too. So like I said, I have all the products tagged on this video so you can easily shop them. I'm so obsessed. Thank you so much Abercrombie for sponsoring this video. I'm so honored. Also, if you guys didn't watch my last vlog when I was home, you wouldn't have seen the transformation that is my room here. It used to be very, not childlike, it was like my high school bedroom, but it just needed some revamp. So I got new pillows, a new comforter, got this lamp for some ambiance. I just kind of cleared this desk with the candles, this little moment, these, because these reminded me of stuff that I have in my apartment in New York City. Um, but yeah, I'm very, 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 very happy, and it was so nice coming home to this. I've actually had a very productive day so far. I woke up this morning, spring chicken. I took Finley for a little hot girl walk, and then I came back, and I got on the spin bike, and I did spin for about 30 minutes, did like a little arm track situation. Feeling good, Finley just got back from his second walk of the morning, he's so spoiled. My mom took him for a walk too. And um, I actually haven't had breakfast yet, which is so unlike me. Um, so I need to whip something up super quick and I'm actually just gonna keep this on because if you guys don't know, I have a podcast called Gals on the Go and I'm having my mom on this week and I'm really, really excited about it. So we're gonna set up for all of that and get it all situated, but I need to eat breakfast first. So my lazy girl hack is cracking my eggs in the pan and just scrambling them in there because I'm a scrambled girl. I like eggs over medium, over easy. I don't love a fried egg. But I don't know, I just like scrambled eggs the best. Got this super cute little spatula. And I wait, I don't turn on the pan yet. Me teaching guys how to make scrambled eggs. So we've got the eggs cooking. I have six of my friends coming to visit me today for the next few days. Delaney just landed from New York. She's about to Uber here. I think she's gonna get here when my mom and I are podcasting. So it's like, just let yourself in. You can hang with Finley. And then the rest of them are either flying from Atlanta or driving down from Georgia. So they're all arriving around like 12, one o'clock. And we're just gonna chill by the pool and it's gonna be so lovely. Getting all set up. We're doing an episode with my mom's, also known as Peaceful Michelle. This is her little meditation room. She's a yoga teacher and she teaches like Zooms in here and has like meetings in here, whatever. Um, she also teaches in person, whatever. But um, yeah, we're doing an episode all about like wellness and my mom's tips because I've learned a lot from her growing up. So the lighting is insanity in here. We're gonna sit like this. I just have to get the camera all set up, but we got the mics. It's so funny, my mom walked down. And she's wearing all white and I'm wearing all black. So it's very fitting for us. Here she is <laughs> Got her white and black She needed a little hot water to get the hot voice going water. for the day. Mm -hmm. There's another little wellness tip for you I'm so excited. This episode's oh. gonna be so good. It might be out by the time this video is up. So mm. Listen up What up? Oh. We just finished podcasting and now the day begins Who's my boy? He said, are you done recording now? Are you done? I'm ready to play. Are you out here with Delaney? So sweet. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. <laughs> ah! Who says that, Mama? The podcast went just seamlessly. My mom did such a good job. She was so nervous at first, it was so funny. Um, and then it just ended up being a great episode. We talk a lot about managing anxiety with meditation and lots of different things. Delaney's here, which I'm so happy about. All the other girls' flights got delayed. They're all on the same plane, but they're not gonna get here till like probably two or three or four. But I need to get some sun. We have a fun night. We're going out in Tampa tonight and I wanna be tan. So I have like a base tan, but I wanna like get out in the sun. It's really hot though, I have to get in the pool. So I got this little pouch here says bikinis and it's so perfect to fit all my bathing suits so I want to wear a bathing suit that I'll get a nice tan from my favorite type of bathing suits to wear 
are like triangle bathing suits where it's like you know you have you do have the one strap but i don't know it's just easy and not offensive so maybe i'll do like the orange one for fun but yeah just like these string bottoms so you can tan your booty a little bit and then just like this vibe swimsuit is on got the beach bag i have so much sunscreen in here i also got this cute little bag from amazon a little spf but i even have like more sunscreen in here this is the book i'm reading right now and i think it's keeping me up at night so i also i mean it's really really good it's just like about a scary house so you know sometimes that might just freak you out at night so i went ahead and also downloaded another book i really want to read called golden girl by ellen hildebrand i read a ton of her books these are books that i've read recently i finished all of them except for this one ironically the things we leave unfinished i cannot get through it so it's just not it's gonna not say red which really bothers me i like how it says red whatever um so i downloaded golden girl to like read during the day by the pool because i think it's me more i don't really know what this book's about but i love ellen hildebrand anything um but i'm also gonna continue reading this when i'm in the mood so i'm gonna pop that in the beach bag too today is saturday so we gotta take my supplements for the day ah! got the suitcase also known as our speaker i hope it's charged too let let the pool party begin finley all right it's time it's get your hair wet day it's a hair wash day <laughs> Let's hold hands. Blaney's here. Mermaids. The other girls just arrived. They're putting on their bathing suits. All right, ready? One, two, three. Summer! <laughs> that was so cringy. <laughs> oh my god! I'm like, summer! <laughs> wow, Delaney. Just wow. I know. Wow, Such a jokester. So it was very salty. It is a saltwater pool, baby. We've got poolside snacks, some Publix chicken sandwiches, chips, and guac and salsa. Dig in. Okay, it doesn't look like my face got tan at all, but got a good tan line. We've been out just chilling by the pool catching up. We did a little book club moment because we all read On a Quiet Street, which is a really good book, and we all had planned to finish reading it by the time we got to Tampa. So we had a held book club by the pool. We have a big night ahead of us. I'm gonna shower and just like chill with my hair in a towel for a second and then get ready for tonight. Nothing like that post pool shower. Cuddled up, I just wanna like charge my social battery um, for going out tonight. So I'm watching a little bit of, um, and just like that, season two, a little gua sha. My face does look like I got some color in this clip, so I don't know. But yeah tonight basically we have a whole night planned at the addition hotel i'm so excited it's brand new to tampa and they have so many restaurants but they also have like um like a club there they have a rooftop and they've basically planned a whole night for us which is really really generous and the kicker we got a party bus because we thought it'd be fun and the addition hotels being so kind and comping the whole night i'm obviously gonna like tip everybody but it's really generous so we were like well we are gonna need ubers throughout the night so we might like leave the addition hotel and go to like south howard ave um which is like a ton of fun bars but we're not sure so it would just be nice to and then that way we don't you know we don't need to take two different cars we can have one it's really extra but we're all pitching in there's seven of us and i'm so excited so we have a fun night ahead a long night ahead so I'm just trying to relax and they're all about to come inside too and shower and all the things. Nobody told me to settle down Day nights and late nights don't get around But there's something about you Something about you I like about you I like You're crazy for saying I should slow down But maybe I'm escaping the love we found There's something about you Something about you I like About you I like I get too drunk and too scared and We're very 
colorful tonight. Um, like a rainbow explosion. We do. We've been putting off putting on our heels, but they're gonna hurt. It is now time. Our party bus. Oh, let me scooch over a little. Our party bus just arrived, and she was like, "Your neighbors are probably like, what's going on? No, no one's birthday. You probably think you know, a celeb is pulling up. Oh yeah, totally. You know. So we're gonna have a night. I'm so excited. Oh, we both have no polish on our toes. I know. I this feel so very vulnerable. I feel really vulnerable actually now that you say that. I picked all of my gel polish off at the pool today. No one needs to know though. I just told everybody. I know the wrap up heels are so cute, but what I think they're mine are comfortable. It's just I hate when they get untied. Mm -hmm. I'm like out of breath. This is a freaking workout, man. Anyhow, this is my outfit. It's like a little set. Situation. It kind of looks like a bathing suit with a sarong, but at the same time, it doesn't. So, oh my gosh, look at this next outfit. Obsessed with this top. Like, love the cut, the black leather pants. Okay. We're about to dance the night away. <laughs> Kenna has arrived. Emmy has arrived. Oh no, they'll dry. <laughs> night last night you guys so we got back at like 2 30 we had so much fun the party bus was just such a move like you don't get like car sick we're vibing out and since there were seven of us it was just it was very ideal we got treated so well at the edition last night highly suggest if you go to tampa there's oh my god we got our whole like private room area with a curtain at the club we could open the curtain if we wanted or we could close it Madeline's currently getting a back rub right now. I'm so jealous. <laughs> um, but we're about to go run some errands. It's Sunday morning, and we're going to do a boat day. I'm getting a phone call. I bet it's um, our driver, Alex. Yes. Um, hello. Hi. Um, we're at Isabella's car. It's just no rush, but we were just telling y'all that's what we are. <laughs> okay. On my way. Me okay. and McKenna will head over. Um, here's my little office right here. Nothing crazy. It's this set from Beyond Yoga. Tank is a neen bang. This is like my new life. This little lemon little bag here. My Brooks sneakers. We're ready to go. Good morning, Finley. Hello. It's a beautiful day to be alive. Toasty. Welcome to Isabella's car. <laughs> whoop whoop. Whoop whoop. Here. I don't know if I've literally. I've been in your car before. Actually, it's a lie. Yeah, you have been out in Georgia Heights before. Yes, you have. What do you send the call? Make sure you enjoy with your knees while Good morning. Good morning. Coming to you live from, from Isabella's car. At Dunkin' Donuts. We're headed to the liquor store to get... Liquor. <laughs> and a Dr. Pepper. And Coke. And... A cola. What else? Long drinks and high noons. And... We're not sure what else. Yeah. To be continued. Right. <laughs> Shut up! That took forever. Oh, you have two. <laughs> one for me, one for Isabella. Uh, thanks! Uh -huh. I don't know why mine is so white. I'm a little nervous. Oh. But we shall see. We shall see. Cheers. Oh, cheers. Oh, yours is so white. It's very, I think she put, I only, or I did get three creams because it's a bigger one. Oh. But, say your coffee order. I believe Danielle ordered mine for me. It is a iced coffee with one cream and two sugars. Mine is a decaf iced coffee with three cream and one sugar. But I think there might be two sugars in here. Mm -hmm. um, but I've been really into just Dunkin' iced coffee. I just like the cups. 
an orange straw. America runs on Duncan. Truly. Um, now we're at Walgreens and the girls are inside getting some Coca-Cola products. Coca-Cola. Everyone's getting their different um, caffeines that they need. Yes. And Isabella goes, don't look at my car emojis. I was like, what do you mean? Yeah, there's a few car emojis here. We cannot show the vlog. It's like crazy. behind her wheel, there's like, you know, when your car's like, you know, need service or this. And those are yeah. car emojis apparently. And I thought that was really funny and I giggled. I texted my dad on the way here a picture of my car emojis and said, I need help. And he read my message and did not respond. <laughs> did so, so you sent him a picture of the ones? Yeah. Uh oh. He didn't really care. Maybe he's researching and seeing. Yeah, he, he likes to research a little. I mean, I know if you showed my dad, he'd be like, oh, okay, we'll do this, we'll do that. We're just going to pretend they're not there. For yeah. Now. So, cheers. Happy Sunday. And go dogs. Yes, go <laughs> dogs, baby. Hi, Finn. Stay here. Come back. This way. What do we got? Come on. What do we got? Another beautiful day. Getting everything all set up for our boat day. Whew. Just stirred up a good old element because it is so hot out. I need to stay hydrated. Trying to figure out what swimsuit to wear today. We're going on the boat. I just love, like I said, wearing swimsuits like this because you get a nice tan line. So like a black one or a green one or I just love this bathing suit. It's so pretty. Um, and it also gave me a pretty good tan line. Maybe I'll do this to be fun. Gonna go with this bikini because it makes me look tanner than I actually am. So I always love that. And it's fine, it's summer. It's dinner time, taco night. Got a whole setup up in here. It was another successful day in the sun. Well, not so successful. I literally reapplied my sunscreen a few times. I mean, my body's fine. My face just got a little extra burnt. I think because when we we're on the boat and we were in, we like went to an island and got off and we were in the ocean, the reflection just really gets you. And I love like a little sun kissed face. However, I don't like when your nose peels. And I think. I keep doing this. I think that's gonna peel. So, okay, so we just finished dinner and we're gonna watch a movie, but the sun is like at that point where it's just in our eyes, so we can't watch a movie yet. So, I'm serenading my friends. Not actually, but we're just playing some piano. Encore. We're just playing a little piano. This is Stay by Rihanna. It's not my best, but we're gonna try. Headed to bed, see you guys in the morning.
Sunday morning. I woke up at 7.30. We all went to bed so early last night. We watched this movie called Rough Night. Highly suggest it's about a bachelorette party that goes bad. I mean, it's like cheesy stupid, but we really, really enjoyed it. It was a good laugh. And we watched like some of Taylor Swift Arrows tour videos on YouTube. It was really fun. And then I went to bed nice and early. So I woke up bright and early at 7.30 and I got a lot of computer work done before my friends woke up. Then I went for a really long walk around the neighborhood with my friend McKenna, got in the sauna, and then I did, or before the sauna, I did like a 20 minute abs, arms, booty workout situation just to like feel good. I just like needed to get some movement in. And I just showered and I'm gonna go join all my friends. They're all out back right now already in their bathing suits. It's like noon. So it feels good to just still be in a routine when I'm home. Um, I should probably have some electrolytes, <laughs> but it's just, it's just really hot outside. But I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. Thank you to Abercrombie for sponsoring this video. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, go follow me at Danielle Carolyn. And I will see you guys next time for my next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.